Hello and thanks for joining me. I am Sugi and today I'm gonna teach you guys how to change languages on a certain servers where you play. Let us say Russia, Turkey, Brazil, Latin America, whatever. So what we do first is we go to open up League of Legends here. And as we can see we have a launch client here and on the top drawbar we have um, select region. We have Brazil, as I said, EU Nordic East, Latin America, North America, Oceania, Russia, Turkey. But for instance, when we go to EU Nordic East, we have, of course, an option to play with certain languages. Okay, but why, when we go to Brazil, we only have Portuguese. So. If we are moving to, let's say, let's go to Russian server, we don't have any other option than the Russian language. So what we do, we're going to do first, we're going to save. And then there's going to be a few initialization when you switch servers. Sometimes you have to download the patch when you move to certain server. And what we could do is we're going to go to my computer, you go to local disk and find where you have Riot Games folder. Usually, this is in under program files, but usually uh, the default, at least for me, is actually on the local disk, not on the program file. So we go to the League of Legends folder, and actually what we're going to do next, we're going to actually close this launcher. And we go to the RATS files, and we go to the system. Then we go to the notepad file called local. 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 I don't know where to say it. Local. And the RU means Russia. Um, this means Russian sounds and Russian um, language. As we, if you want to change the um, language to um, English, we use NGB. This is the what we use. And then there is, if you want to use the Brazilian, um, you use BR, BR, etc. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna change it to English right now, okay? And this is a very hefty trick and it is not illegal or anything so you don't have to worry about it. Then we save it, then we close it, and then we open the launcher again. And voila! We are in the Russian server and we have an English client. And it's all in English, as you can see. And when we open to the actual... Um, we'll go inside the client. There's some. There's few things that are really important, though. Um, aside from this, first of all, we have the um, some when people write Russian in the Russian server right now, they will appear as boxes to you. If there are letters like that, they will appear as such. Um, there might be some. Um, as for Turkey and other servers, there shouldn't be this thing. But this is like a Russian thing. I'm not 100% sure are you able to use Korean and Chinese, but it should be KR underscore KR and CN underscore CN. And that's how you do it. If you happen to, um, uh, let us go back to the launcher again. If you happen to change the actual um, server again, let's go back to EU Nordic. And then we go back to Russia it will reset the local file. Now it's in back in Russian, so you always have to do this process if you're switching around servers. But as long as you play on the same server, it doesn't change the actual language and sounds. Uh, hopefully this was uh, really helpful for you. Um, please do um, subscribe, share and like. If you have questions, leave them on below. I will answer them. And see you guys later on the next video. Thanks for watching once again.